Hi everyone, Simply Red here. I hope you had a great, great week. We only have one more week of school and then we're out for our Christmas break. So I am here on a Friday night, exhausted, but I am so excited to show you my Stitch Fix. Now I have already opened this box. I was hoping to find something in it uh, to wear to an event last night. So I opened it yesterday. Um, I just, I actually, I changed my mind. I wore something very casual and comfortable last night. And so, uh, there are a few cute sweaters in here. I did not wear them, but let me show you what's inside. Uh, my stylist is Jenny. Now I have a new stylist and I was going to read to you her note. Uh, you remember my last fix was an all black box and I did get the, um, the long black cardigan, the fair isle print black cardigan. And I just love that, but I did request a, a cheaper box this time with the holidays uh, around the corner. I thought, you know what, I'm just going to see what they have. So I told her I wanted something without acrylic and something without polyester and a little bit cheaper. And so let's read what she said. She said, um, I'm so excited about styling you. I hope you're doing fantastic. I'm sorry your previous fix was not in the price range you prefer, which it was okay, but I only purchased the one thing. So uh, she said, this fix is about correcting that for you based on your request for sweaters. Since you want them without acrylic or polyester, that is exactly what I've made sure to pull for you. Let's get your fashion show started. <laughs> That's cute. The 41 Hawthorne pullover in the printed pattern is simply stunning. Floral is very popular this season, so you're right on trend. The beautiful light blue sweater is also gorgeous and will be perfect for wearing with your favorite jeans for the holiday festivities that are just around the corner. Layer on the denim jacket with these super cute and lightweight sweaters and you're set. The Cyrus cow neck sweater is going to keep you cozy. Best to you, Jenny. Okay, so here's the style card. And it's kind of a blue theme. Um, and I have to be honest with you, blue is not a color that I reach for. I usually, you know, gravitate towards dark green and burgundy and purple. But I am excited. This is what Stitch Fix is all about, trying new things. So let's look at the first sweater. And this is a beautiful blue. It's kind of um, like a... It's not quite a periwinkle, but it's not a sky blue either. I like it. Uh, it's thin. What do y'all think about this color on me? It's kind of different. I might, I might give it a try. Uh, it is, this is the, I'm going to have to put my glasses back on. This is the, uh, what'd she say? Huh? Market and Spruce. Yeah, this is the Market and Spruce. And it is a medium. And let's just see what the fabric content is real quick. Uh, I don't know. I just don't like acrylic. I just get too hot. So this is uh, cotton and, and uh, rayon and nylon. Good. All right. It's a little thin, but I like it. And like she said, she said to uh, layer it with a denim jacket. It kind of has an open weave here at the shoulder. And then, uh, you know, it's kind of a solid. And then it has that open weave again uh, here at the bottom of the sleeve. And it's about mid-length. It's not short and it's not a, a tunic either. But uh, I think I'm going to like this pretty good. So let's, we'll try that on. And I think I really like this one as well. Now, this is the floral she was talking about. And this is the 41 Hawthorne in a medium. Let me move the tag. This is pretty too. I like this. What do y'all think about this print? Hmm. It's kind of a rusty burgundy with a bright navy blue. And let's just see what this is made out of. It's kind of a thing with me. I always look at the fabric. Same type material, cotton, rayon, and nylon. So, And it's a thinner uh, sweater as well. Okay. Hmm. I'm not sure about this one. And here is the denim jacket. Now I already have two denim jackets. I have a light wash and then I have a really dark Levi denim jacket that I've had for a while. Um, this one is the darker wash 
and it says it's by Just USA and it's in a medium. And I can tell you right now, I think it's gonna be a little bit too tight. It's cut pretty um, narrow, but it's pretty. And I love to wear denim jackets. So um, it does feel like it has quite a bit of stretch. So we'll have to see about this. I really like it though. Okay, and another sweater here. And this is a, uh, hmm, it's a gray. I couldn't tell if it was gray or olive uh, last night when I was looking at it. But it is the, the gray cowl neck. And this is the uh, evolution, it says, in a medium. And it's kind of a, hmm, it's kind of got a ribbed with a little um, sleeve here. It's more of a tunic length. Hmm, I really like this. And you know me, I love my gray and my solids and kind of the dull colors, but. Uh, I like this. I love a cow neck. Uh, it has kind of a seam up the front and down the back. And it has a little um, curved hem. And let's check out the fabric content in this one. Probably the same. Uh, let's see. Hmm, it doesn't say. Oh, yeah, it does. Ray, rayon and nylon. So, uh she did what I asked. Awesome. Oh, and there's one more thing. Let's try that sweater on here in a minute. There is a purse, and she didn't mention that in the note. And let's see. Hmm. I think it's a dark blue. It kind of looks gray, but it's a blue. It's a little crossbody. And this is by Moto Lux. It's the Ella Fold Over Crossbody. It is in navy. It says navy. So it has a little snap and it has a little pocket here and it has the strap here, inside pockets. Let's see, it's got one pretty large one. That's a cute little fabric on the inside, isn't it? And a zippered pocket here. And let's see if it has anything on the outside. No, but it does unzip here. Hmm, I what this does. Oh, it just, hmm. Okay, the zipper is just for looks, I guess, because it doesn't really do anything. See, it just kind of opens it up a little bit, maybe. What is this? Oh, this is kind of weird. Okay, so there's another zipper on top right here in the flap. And it just goes to right here. So we have a compartment here, here, two pockets on the inside. And then I guess this is just a little detail there that little zipper and it opens it up just a little on the bottom. Hmm. I can be honest with you, I've never had this color bag before. Um, I think it'll be gorgeous with the sweaters, the gray and then that blue, uh, the denim. So this is a maybe. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. I have to think about this one. All right, so let me try this on for you and we'll see what it all looks like and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, I'm so excited. This jacket is not too small. It fits perfect. So this is the Just USA denim jacket, and it's in a medium, and I have it over that blue sweater. Um, we'll talk about that in just a second, but uh, I love the jacket. It fits really well. It's got a lot of stretch to it. It's a real comfortable denim. The sleeves were a little bit long on me, but I do have shorter arms, so I just turned them up here and it has great pocket placement so um real comfortable pocket uh it's a really good denim jacket and i have two but this one's a little bit different so i'm considering this one i really really like it i think she did a good job of course it's all cotton and a little bit of stretch so uh it's very comfy okay so now let's talk about this blue sweater what do y'all think about this color on me? I never pick blue. I don't know why. I think maybe this shade is good. I don't like a royal blue. I like navy and I like this blue uh, now that I have it on. So what do y'all think? I like the sweater. It's very comfortable. Uh, it's kind of on the thin side, but 
with a jacket or a cardigan, it would be perfect. It's kind of a medium length. Um, let me turn the camera down just a little bit and you can see. It's kind of a medium length. Um, but I like it. I thought maybe you might be able to see through this weave, but you really can't. I like the neck. I like the sleeves. This is the market and spruce. Okay, so let me try on the other floral sweater and I'll grab the, oh, and the gray sweater and I'll grab the purse. So I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the 21 Hawthorne and this is the little floral sweater. Um, I'm not crazy about this one. I like it okay. It's just that, you know, thin, kind of plain. Of course, the print is bold. Uh, here to have it with just some denim jeans. Um, I can't decide. I don't really, it just doesn't speak to me. I don't know why. I think it's, I don't know. I just can't, I can't explain it. I guess it's the pattern. Uh, so, and for the price, I'm going to tell you about the price here in just a minute. I'll probably pass on this one, but uh, let me know what you think. Okay, and I'll try on the gray. Be right back. Okay, this is the gray, uh, the long tunic with the cow neck, and this is the Evolution, it's called. It's a tunic. Uh, it's got, the sleeves are a little bit long again. I have short arms, but what I would do is just turn it up one. Uh, it's kind of a silvery gray, isn't it? It's a different color. I don't have a sweater this color. I have dark or light gray. This is kind of a medium got a little sheen to it. I kind of like it. What do y'all think? Here's the, the length. Um, it's got the, you know, the, um, the rayon, so it's not itchy or scratchy or hot. It's pretty soft, different. Uh, this would be beautiful with black leggings and some black booties, which I have. So I'm trying to decide on this one. I'm really torn because I love that blue, but I like this as well. It's very comfortable. Um, I don't know. What do y'all think? It's pretty? Mm -hmm. Cute. Okay, so, uh, oh, I was going to grab that purse. Uh, where did I put it? Oh, it's just right here. Let me grab the purse and let's just kind of see. Oh, I didn't undo the strap. Um, well, I'll just kind of hold it up. You can look at it again. I forgot to undo the strap. I think I'm gonna pass on the purse. I, I just don't think I'll reach for it. I think the color is just kind of strange. It's, it's a blue gray color, which is different if you're looking for a different purse, but um, I think I'm gonna pass. I really don't need it, so I'm gonna pass on that, but I think I like this. So let me uh, come back with the recap and I'll tell you what the prices are. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and let's talk about this one first. This is that beautiful gray, that silvery gray cow neck sweater. It's that tunic length. I love this. Uh, they're calling this the Cyrus Fawny Cow Neck Rib Pullover in dark gray. And this is a medium and this is $68. This is kind of a pricey box um, for just sweaters and a jacket. Well, in a purse, uh, but it is a $300 box. Um, of course, with your 25% um, discount, if you buy all five, that brings it down to $225. And then when you apply your $20 styling fee, that'll bring it down to $205. Uh, so I need to make a decision. So I love this, but I need to decide. I really like the blue. So y'all tell me if I get the blue, and this is the Market and Spruce, and it is also, um, or it is, the Market and Spruce is 58. So <clears throat> if I get the blue, which I'm thinking about getting this color, so I don't know what shoes to wear. Do I wear black, brown, just doesn't seem to fit. I think, honestly, this sweater would be beautiful in the spring with a pair of white denim jeans and some really cute little white uh, sandals. <laughs> not very wintry to me and it is about to get 
pretty chilly here. Uh, I am actually going up to Missouri for Christmas and it's gonna be snowing and I just don't know what shoes to wear. I mean, it would be cute with that denim jacket and then my coat, I guess black, maybe a black coat, black, black jeans and black booties. So y'all tell me what you think. I like it and I wanna get it, but I need to know how to style it. Um, I guess I could look at her styling card. Let's just see what, what she has with it. I've got to look at that. Uh, okay, well, she has it with a skirt <laughs> and um, like a little olive khaki jacket. Hmm. But here she has it styled with a skirt. So uh, that doesn't help me because I'm not gonna be wearing a skirt anytime soon. Um, so I need y'all's help. Y'all tell me, what do you think? If I get this, what do I do? Okay, um, the floral, 21, I mean, 41 Hawthorne is just not for me. I don't, I tried to like it because of the colors, but I just don't like the, the print. And I think it just was a little bit too tight. Uh, so I'm going to pass. This is the, um, what's this one called? This is called the 41 Hawthorne Maisie printed crew neck pullover and they're calling it burgundy and it is $58. So I'm going to pass on this. Uh, but the denim jacket, this is a great denim jacket. If you are looking for a really good quality denim, uh, it's called Just USA. It has just enough stretch. It is uh, a good color. It's very, I thought it was very well made and very slimming. It was not too bulky. It fit, fit really well. Uh, and let's see how much this is. I think this is 68. Yeah, the denim jacket is 68. Um, but I think it's probably worth the price. I'm going to pass though since I already have the two. So that's going to be a pass. And then finally, the uh, crossbody. And they're calling it navy. And this is the Moda Lux Ella Foldover Crossbody. It's cute. Um, it's $48. And uh, I like it okay, it's different. It's got the little zipper detail, but I have a couple already that I picked up. Uh, I don't know if I will reach for this color. It doesn't really go with a lot in my wardrobe. So I'm gonna pass on this. So now I need to decide on this or the blue. I really like this and I don't think I'm gonna get both because of the price. Um, 58 each. I don't know. This is so pretty. Um, but I think I'm going to just get the blue. So let me know what you think. And I will, uh, let you know, um, in my next video, if I get it, I guess. So have a great, great weekend. I hope you, uh, have a Merry Christmas. If I don't see you before then, I know I'm going to be traveling and, uh, I might try to do another video before I leave. But the last week of school is so, so busy, I'm going to be just swamped. Uh, but I am going up to the St. Louis area to visit my daughter for Christmas. And I'm thinking about vlogging up there. Um, you know, we travel quite a bit, but we uh, normally just, you know, I never vlog. Uh, so I thought this might be kind of fun. Let me know if you'd like to see that. And I will be happy to uh, kind of take you along a little bit. We are going to go to some really neat places in St. Louis. Um, I'm hoping to see a little bit of snow and of course, you know, visit with family. So, uh, I hope you have a great weekend and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.